Okay, so today I'm going to post a very strong review about some Krylon and Rust-Oleum paint. Um, I like to use all of it and I'm a serious crafter like during Christmas and I just want to make this video for my fellow crafters so that they don't go through this drama. But it is uh, November the 1st of 2020 and I have been back to Lowe's in Daphne, Alabama three times to exchange Rust-Oleum's just their glitter splays. Now I love their regular pa uh, paints. I have no problem with them. I love all paints. But I want to show you something. So, I have exchanged this red blast glitter three times and then finally got a can and used it one time and it worked. Went to go use it again and this is what's happened. It looks like a solid pea string, as in like my dog is getting to my pole. So this is all you're going to get or it's not going to work at all. Now, Lowe's took it back two times but the amount of time that it takes to take them back over and over and you know how it is when you return something. So this one is the Silver Glitter Blast by Rust-Oleum and it just doesn't work at all. Full can. So then I had the green, which I got so mad that I slung it into the trash can. So I took it back two times. So I'm not doing that anymore. So Rust-Oleum, I don't know what your deal is with your glitter blast, but you're making people pay seven to eight dollars a can to use it once. Now, I want you to see a can that's been in my craft thing for about three years. It's the Krylon, it's just straight glitter blast. There you go. Now I don't know if they have colors, so I can't rate the colors. But literally, I mean, no cleaning, no nothing. So kudos to Krylon Glitter Blast. That's only in the, these two are silver and diamond dust. And Rust-Oleum, I am actually wanting to send this to you because I really would like either a refund or a credit or something. But crafters, don't do this to yourself because it really, really got off with me. So anyway, that's my review. Be blessed. And until next time, later.